name to. You see, Father's not a farmer. He's a storekeeper, a merchant. Oh, that's different. Then you won't need a lawman to sort of look after you, will you? Of course not. But thanks anyway. Oh, babe. Come on, Ed. Come on, boy. Cleaned them out. What's the use of an outlaw having so much money? He can't spend it. Well, he thinks he can. Well, he's getting so sure of himself, a man wouldn't believe it. Beg pardon, gents. You mind if we use some of this walk? I saw him first. Five dishes of ice cream. Mm. Yeah, make them double dishes. Mart, you cover the rear. There's a big one for you. Hey, you don't eat ice cream, do you? Yeah. <laughs> well, I figured on eating all five of them. Yeah. Reach high and quick. You can't do that. He's my partner. I got him. Him and his partner both. Hey, what's wrong? Oh. We ain't done nothing. What's the matter? Well, Mr. Page? What can I do for you gents in the land office? The administration has sent me to find out why cattlemen are allowed to run settlers off the public land. Ain't that a local problem? I'm afraid you don't realize it's a national problem. We must have room for the crowded people of the East, land where they can safely settle. Their protection is your duty. And what are you doing about it, Marshal? There's nothing I can do about it, except feel sorry for the poor devils. You should be able to control a few cattlemen, you a United States Marshal. That's just it, Page. Being a federal officer, I can act only in offenses against the United States government. Nestor's is a local problem. Then as far as you're concerned, there's nothing can be done to stop the robbery and killing of innocent men and women? What is this? Well, these men claim I'm Billy the Kid, and it ain't so. That here's a man who knows me. Yeah, but who knows him? Well, he does. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyhow. I'm not the man you want. I'm Roy Rogers from Texas. Everybody knows you can lie faster than a hound dog can lick a plate. You think so? Well, then take a look at this. Deputy Roy Rogers, Sheriff's Office, San Antonio, Texas. I know where he got that. Off the last man he killed. Son, you better give an account of yourself. Well, I'm here looking for a job. Everybody knows we got no jobs for outside punchers. But I can do more than punch cattle. I've been a sheriff's deputy and I've wrangled horses. Yeah, and he's a musician, too. Yep, we know what sort of music. Finger exercises on a 45. It just happens that Billy the Kid can't play a note or sing one either. We'll call your bluff. Get that guitar. Cool customer, isn't he? Thanks, partner. What shall I sing? No, anything. I wonder why he feels so happy. Words should rhyme, but who's got time? Just sing a little song about anything. I wonder why he feels so happy. I know lots of things worth knowing, but you won't have a need of an education where you're a going. I am haunted. You mean wanted. Sing a little song about anything. Wonder why I feel so happy. What do you think of a crazy ginkgo feel so cheerful? Is he a guy who never cries? Oh, how fearful. Sing a little song about anything. Wonder why I feel so happy. Do you suppose the fellow knows the meaning of worry? One of the few who's never blue or in a hurry. Sing a little song about anything. I wonder why I feel so happy. I know lots of things worth knowing. But you won't have a, a need of an education where you're a-going. I'll be singing 
you mean swing and sing a little song about anything. I wonder why I feel so happy. You boys ready to admit you made a mistake? Let me through. He shot my brother. Let me at him. There's only one man that can shoot like that. Now try and claim you're not Billy the Kid. Hold on there. What's the trouble, Dave? We're still finding out what's up. Put that glow coat fool under arrest. The rest of you, get out. Not you. Come back here. How about our reward? Sure, we brought him in. Huh? You mean I did? You can wait until we figure out who you brought in. Come on, Pat. What do you mean you brought him in? Won't do you no good to lie at yard, Billy. There's a man that knows you. Yes, I knew Billy well. Rode the range with him and was his friend until he went wrong. Looking at you, I'd swear you was him. But you're not. How do you know, Pat? Because I killed Billy last night. That's too bad. Your point of view is hard to understand, Marshal. What's too bad about killing a murderous outlaw? When it comes to protecting those poor nesters you were so worried about, Billy was more used to me than all my deputies. He had the ranchers plum buffaloed. How do you know? They mistook me for Billy the Kid, and they sure took out on a high low. 